Puebla. Before we continue on to this video, please be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. Also, <clears throat> if you would like to help in the construction of building my city, please be sure to donate at GoFundMe.com slash Afroboy. Now enjoy this program. What is good YouTube? It is the one and only Afroboy here and in today's video, I did have a live commentary set up for you guys. But for some reason the sound didn't come out, so I'm just going to go ahead and re-record over this video. But before we even get into this video, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. And now, let's officially begin. Alright, so yesterday Rockstar announced that there will be an update coming September 15th, which is Tuesday of this week. A new update. And it will be the same day that Destiny Taken Kings come out. <laughs> And that's perfect for me because now I have more things to play on Tuesday and throughout the week. But this update consists of certain things. Now, the biggest thing is that this will only be for next gen. I'm sorry, last gen, but um, I don't know if this will be. If Ill Guidance 2 was the last update for last gen, I don't know if it was. I don't know if it will be, but this update will not be for last gen. It'll only be for um, next gen. Only because that um, the no loading screens and also something special that I got to tell y'all about when I get to it. But after all that, let's say something else. All right. Next thing is now let's talk about these game modes here. All right. So the game modes will be in free roam events. So these are free roam events. So you'll be in free roam. And boom, it'll pop up. Mm, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, it's a free roam event. Let's go to it. <laughs> but now there are many of them, but um, they only announced four of them right now. So the biggest ones are King of the Castle. Now, King of the Castle is basically there will be a designated spot that you have to get to. Now, once you're at this spot, you will be considered king of the castle, and everybody in the lobby has to come and try to beat the wrong you. Now, I'm guessing that when the time, whoever is the king of the castle, when the time runs down, that will be considered the actual king of the castle and actually win the rewards, whether it be money, RP. It would be cool if they gave out some shirts now, shirts that says king of the castle. That ought to be dope, but... I don't know if they even do that, but hopefully Rockstar is listening to this video and hears me out with that. And hopefully they do come out with something like that. But the next game will be Hunt the Beast. Now this one sounds pretty cool. So basically a volunteer in the lobby will be turned into a werewolf who will be faster, stronger, and they must escape um, the people that are chasing them in the lobby. So everybody in the lobby will chase after you if you are the beast, which would be a werewolf. If you are the werewolf, you will have to escape them. And I'm guessing there will be a timer, just like the king of the castle. And if you escape them long enough and you don't get killed, then I guess you'll win the rewards or whatever they're gonna be given. Now, the next one is called the hunting pack. It says, you're a part of a team tasked to deliver a priority vehicle rigged to explode if it drops below the speed limit while your opponent races, rams, and battle you to take you down. Now, that game mode sounds cool, too, now. So, you have to stay at a constant speed, and there's going to be people trying to knock you off and everything. And, of course, you're going to have your team around you trying to keep them from touching you and keep you at that speed so that way it won't blow up and you'll be able to complete the challenge. Now, the next one is called Cross the Line. It says, we're heavily... Armed squads faces off um, across a neutral zone with the goal of having all team members stra strategically, ah, strategically <laughs> wow, <laughs> penetrate their opponent's territory to claim victory. Now, so that's pretty dope. But now there is a one big thing that I was talking about early in this video. Rockstar Editor will be coming in this update. Boom. Pow, all that. We talking about PC cinematics. We'll be, able, we'll be able to record and do all that now on console. Now, Rockstar did say that they were bringing this, but I didn't think that it was going to be guaranteed because look how long it took for Heist to come out. But they actually followed through on this. Rockstar Editor will be coming on September 15th, which is this Tuesday. So, guys, expect cinematic movies short clips and all that from me from now on because i've been trying to do this but i wasn't able to do this and it was only because one reason i didn't feel like 
doing all of this recording, chopping, cutting, and all of that. It was going to be so time consuming. It's going to take a long time. But now it is possible to do this within the game without having to upload and send it to different places and get it to my computer and cut it, chop it all up. Now we can just do it on the game. And that would be awesome. Just like I said, expect that from me. I don't know how long it's going to take me to get it out, but just expect it. But Tuesday, September 15, yeah, I might be bringing GTA gameplay first. This only because my friends, they don't get out of school until like 3 o'clock. So I get out of school early because I only have two classes. So I get out at 11. So I'll be able to upload the GTA videos first. And then when they get home and everything, then that's when the Taken King videos is coming out. Now, I might upload one, you know, just by myself to showing y'all around and stuff. I might do that, but I really don't know. I might just go ahead and wait until my friends get there so that way it would be fun and be more entertaining to y'all. But just like I said, look out me for Tuesday, September 15th. Be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. It's the one and only Alpha Boy, and I'm out. Peace.